Good morning, pretty peaks, and today's Manny of the Week is going to be Rule of Plum, a really pretty floral design that I have been keeping my eye on for quite a bit of time. So first things first, we're going to open up our strips, take these bad boys out. We have our alcohol swab, and we should have our, yes, our nail file. Now, my nails have been cleaned, nail polish remover, but as you see, I have a little bit of a broken one here. I have a little strengthener that I'm playing with, so hopefully that will continue to help my nails heal from that dip that I did for my birthday. But first things first, you're just going to clean off your nails with a bit of alcohol. This is just going to remove the oils that are setting up on your on your nails throughout your day and any moisturizers that you have. The cleaner, the drier they are, the better off that they will cure. All right, so let's get this bad boy open. And let's see, oh, I will say, I can't, sometimes I can't believe that this is just nail polish. Look at the freaking designs on this. This is amazing. So as rule of thumb, we are going to, rule of thumb, rule of thumb, <laughs> we are going to be starting off with our pinky. So take your protective layer off here is your foil we just remove here. Is that Jeanette? Hey, Jeanette, how art thou? Let's see. Okay, so then you just lift it down. So for me, I like to have it a little bit lower just because I like to move it on down. And then you just get it nice and smooth. Hello, Tara, how are you? And then I honestly, I'm lazy. I'm using my finger and then I just seal it off. Isn't that pretty? And then my nails are short, so I just take off my little cuticle here, and then I just place it again on the next nail. Where's my Angie? Angie has just gone down for her nap. I literally had to wait until she took a nap because she is running everywhere. You know she's going to be 15 months now, right? All right, so we got one and two, and for me, I now that Angie's asleep, I can actually do this in the order that I want to, so... Start very slowly, take off your protective coat, get your foil. Where are your boys? Are they at school right now? Or your girls, I'm sorry. I was with my sis with my one of my friends and she has a son who's very rampant too. So we go ahead, take that down, and then we go ahead and flip this one over and we go ahead and just do the next nail oh i know i'm gonna get so many compliments tara how are you doing today i believe she um I, she was actually one of the new one new ladies that i met during trunk or treat are your kids sugared up yet all right not too bad now let's see what's gonna work on this one i don't know i think i've been kind of playing around with ombre mix manis and i like it i like looking that i actually tried <laughs> Tried to do something with my nails. All right, so get it nice and smooth and then tuck it under. Yes, so pretty. All right, and I'll do the same thing. I'll just flip this over and put it on this middle finger. I, I will say, I was a little bit reserved when it comes to the purples, but you know, now that it's November, I'm, I'm feeling a little, you know, mature, a little bit romantic, and dang it, this is definitely going to work. And for those people that have been nervous about, oh, my nails are short, how is this going to work? It works just like this. Isn't this pretty? I figured she was napping. It's my nap time, too. <laughs> son is in school now. What is he making you next? Jeanette's son is Chef Boyardee. He makes all these really, really delicious things, and I'm hoping that he will make extra for so he can share it with me soon. All righty, so I'm going to keep it going here. I hope you do take a nap, Miss Jeanette. Miss Jeanette has had knee surgery, and so one of the things we have to keep reminding her is to sit down and take a rest. <laughs> But then again, you guys could say the same thing about me. <laughs> All right, so here we go. Nice and smooth, getting it around, moving it nice and smoothly. And then just literally just tucking it under with my thumb. And I know you see that there's a couple of imperfections. No worries, I'm going to show you how to fix those, okay? All right, last but not least, we are going to play with our thumb. Now, you may be asking, oh, Kim, you got a whole bunch of different little strips there. What are you going to do? Well, I was trifling, right? I kept, I had my pedicure on for like, five weeks <laughs> so I'm gonna take the rest of this set and I'm gonna do my toes really quickly 
And don't worry, I'll show you a picture of how it works because that's the question that I get. Does it work for toes? Absolutely, it does, and I'll show you. All right, but first things first, let's get the fingers done because this is the easiest part to film. All right, and same thing. If you take your time, you can literally have this done in under 10 minutes. All right, so here we go. Not too bad at all. Now, the best part about this set, um, not only is it the, because of the design, so it is able to cover a lot of my dip set damage, but because my nails are short, literally flipping the nail strip over kind of helps me to make sure that I get a simple mani-pedi out. Now, this orange stick, you literally can just get an orange stick from any, any supermarket or I think probably they actually have them in the Dollar Tree too. Um, or if you actually are scheduling parties with me and you're local, I'll be able to um, bring these for you. Um, which reminds me, I do have my party date. Um, my schedule is starting to fill up, so if you are looking to have a party in your local, let me know. And if you're not local, let me know because I'm actually scheduling my Black Friday online parties too. Why would you want to consider that? Well, do you like free stuff? Heck yeah, I do. Uh, if you do um, schedule any type of party with me and your people are falling in love with Color Street as much as you are, then you have the opportunity to earn free stuff. Especially for the holidays, I like free, especially when it comes to gifting. If I don't have to pay for it and it's still quality stuff that makes people happy, that works in my favor. All right, so we're just finishing up here. And then again, so when, so I'm trying to slow down so you guys can see what I'm doing. With my orange stick, all I'm doing is just pushing back my cuticles. I am not paying any attention to the actual nail polish itself. I am just focusing on my cuticle space, tucking everything in. What's up, Dallas? How you been, girly? You are the busiest woman ever. <laughs> Literally, like you guys think I'm busy. Dallas is everywhere all the time. All right, so again, just going ahead, tucking under. I do, you do what, Miss Jeanette? So again, just tucking in, tucking in, and getting things nice and smooth. Now, for those, I have some people that say, I can't do that orange stick thing. Here's a trick. If your nail, if your cuticles are moist, you'll be able to push them back. All right, so that is it. And right on schedule, ooh, hold on. <laughs> That's not it. So again, last in-depth little sneak peek trick here. Again, and some places are gonna be a lot easier to do than others, just pushing your cuticles back, getting it nice and neat, tucking things in, because as you tuck things in, it just lays down nice and happy. And if it doesn't, you see how it perforates away? And I know you guys hear my cue. My baby is awake from her nap, so I'm going to finish up here. But the best part is I'm done with my Manny and I'm finished. So now I get to go with my baby. Isn't that pretty? Rule of plum, guys. All right, I will show you how my pedicure looks in a bit, but I hope you guys enjoy, and I'll talk to you later. Bye.